Hartley Brewer Savage's remainer after he claims EU is entitled to threaten Britain. Former Labour MP Lord Hayne claimed Brussels is entitled to have the powers to sanction Britain after Brexit by restricting access to the single market while ignoring the European Court of Justice ECJ, legal process. A leaked report from the EU sets out plans to trap Britain into the Brussels bloc during the so-called implementation period. Talk radio host Julia Hartley Brewer asked whether Lord Hayne struggles when he hears such threats from the EU, who are supposed to be Britain's friends. She added, Do you really think that this is an organization that the British people will want to be part of? In response, the former Labour politician said, these are newspaper headlines which are saying threats. I just think we've got to understand that there has been a sense of denial about it. Hartley Brewer hit back and read a section of the report claiming that Brussels will ground flights, suspend single market access and impose trade tariffs. Lord Hayne said it was not a threat but a reality of leaving the single market. Hartley Brewer said, that's why I voted to leave. She continued to quiz the Remainer and asked him whether the Spanish economy would survive without the millions of Brits flying there every single year. She added, This is nonsense. In response, he said, It is in both our interests to maintain the same things. So what the European Union are saying isn't a threat, it's a statement of fact. Because if we want to maintain that same access we have got to comply with the same rules. Now people, like you who voted to leave the European Union to get rid of their rules. That's fine. Then you've got to face up to the consequences. The Financial Times revealed how the EU plans to make Britain abide by ECJ law during the transition while excluding it from any decision-making. The five-page document says the final withdrawal agreement should provide for a mechanism allowing the Union to suspend certain benefits deriving from the UK from participation in the internal market where it considers that referring the matter to would not bring in appropriate time the necessary remedies. The EU could essentially have the power to put restrictions on airline operating rights or cross-border financial services. The government responded to the claims made in the document and dismissed it as a draft that is still to be negotiated. Brexit Secretary David Davis came under scrutiny after agreeing a two-year transition period where Britain is effectively set to stay in the single market and customs union during the transition. Brexiteer Jacob Rees-Mogg said Britain will be a vassal state during the transition period if it continues to be subject to the European Court of Justice ECJ pay into the EU budget and follow new single market rules.